How do gamers make their YouTube videos? Here's a full guide. In this video, I will be showing you how I and other gamers edit their YouTube videos. And I will also show you guys how gamers can improve their content. Now here are the major steps of making a good quality video. 1. Planning the video. 2. Filming gameplay and from your webcam. 3. It's editing. And 4. It's publishing it on YouTube. First is planning, and this depends on your channel. So if you have a gameplay or montage channel, search up songs or put your favorite clips in one video. Just normal gameplay videos don't do well on YouTube because they're pretty boring, and I suggest you to go with a montage style or talk in your gameplay instead of just showing it. The easiest channels to grow on YouTube if you're in gaming are tutorial or news type of content. This is where you talk about games, bugs, updates, or show YouTube viewers how to do something in game. This is a very easy way to start and find video ideas because games always have something new every once in a while and it's pretty fun to research more on games so that you can know what is new. These channels plan their videos by recording and researching what they found adding gameplay or videos on the new updates and posting them on YouTube. Now that you've found what topics you want to talk about or what game you want to play, the next step is recording it. If you have a gaming PC, you can use OBS or if you have a GPU like Radeon or NVIDIA's, you can use their screen recorders. Windows has one too and it's pre-installed. For console players, I'm pretty sure you can clip things but for a limited time so that sucks. And I'm sorry but I think you can only post montages or gameplay play videos. For mobile, you can use the default screen recorders for iPhone or Android, but you can download one too. Mobile is actually pretty good for editing videos because of all the video editors out there. Check out D Minutes channel if you are into mobile video editing, but even though they're not as advanced as PC editors, it still gets the job done. For console, I think you can only put clips and music and not all the extra PC features that it can get. So while you're editing, if you're making a Touch, let's say, put all your clips in one video editor and place them side by side. I'm going to use Shotcut as an example because most people think it's the easiest video editor to learn and that's what I use. So just put the clips side by side so you can use the transition tool and add all these transitions. If you do updates on games, search up the update and its patch notes or screenshot the new thing that changed in game. You can also edit it to make it on top of the gameplay. Or if you're testing a new item out in game, or you're using an item in game and you want to record the gameplay, use that. Some tips for gaming editors are to trim out all the times that you're in a boring place in game. Like if you're just running for 30 seconds, no one wants to see that and they're probably gonna click off, so cut that out. If you have a mic, make sure people can hear you over your gameplay. So you have to adjust the volume in each clip of your video editor. Also, adding a part of the best clips in the beginning of the video will make your viewer engage and want to stick to the end so if you get that like final kill or something that could be a good hook or intro the final step is to publish your video and what you want to do here is come up with a title that fits your video i wouldn't exceed more than 60 characters because people can see the whole title include a bright and colorful thumbnail too because gamers like all that this video isn't meant for someone who wants more views but if you're interested in that search it up and you'll see a ton of channels related to getting more views if this helped leave a comment telling me and i'll most likely reply if you want to learn more about gaming or you just want to know more about games subscribe i post videos weekly and you'll be missing out on a ton of things you might want to know about gaming thanks for watching and let's have a discussion about this in the comments below